Hot button issue over undocumented immigrants. It's putting the mayor of L.A. on a collision course with the L.A. City Council. Council members are going to tackle the issue of sanctuary cities tomorrow. KCAL 9 political reporter Dave Bryan live in Westwood with more tonight. Dave? Lena and Jeff, this is one of those issues that's about defining who we are, what we are, what we're all about as a city. And tomorrow, that's what the city council will be debating in terms of sanctuary and immigration. On Friday, two L.A. City Council members, Gil Cedillo and Council President Herb Wesson, intend to introduce a motion that would officially designate Los Angeles as a sanctuary city. Some critics charge it would be tantamount to inviting the federal government to cut off millions of dollars in federal funding to L.A., which the Trump administration is already pushing hard to do, ultimately hurting the very citizens the council says it's protecting. What do we want? But supporters like Joseph Valela, who's the policy director for CHURLA, the Coalition for Humane Immigrants' Rights, says it's the right thing to do. He says officially designating L.A. as a sanctuary city sends a strong message to the local community and to the White House that L.A. is not going to hide what it is. I think our elected officials have shown, such as the, the city attorney, our mayor, and, and council president, as well as other elected officials in our city, that they're willing to, to fight this administration by changing to a sanctuary city. Uh, it reflects a new uh, dynamic. Harim Uziel is with a group called Los Angeles for Trump. He says declaring L.A. as officially a sanctuary city is the worst thing the city council could do. It doesn't benefit anyone for the city or any state to become a sanctuary city or state because what they're doing is harboring criminals that are doing hard crimes against us and protecting them from being fully persecuted and from getting them kicked out of our country. And in the middle is Mayor Eric Garcetti, who's always been supportive of immigrants' rights policies. But when pressed on the issue in a recent interview by KNX, the mayor said it, designating L.A. as a sanctuary city is something questionable because he says it's not accurate and it becomes inflammatory. But a lot of these are the same kids that you're just talking about who you have great empathy for. Yep. And to them, it means a lot to be in a city that considers itself no. to be a sanctuary city. I think city. the flip side is that most people define and has been defined as a place where somehow criminals are welcomed. If you have, un if you're undocumented bonus points, I mean, just listen to right wing, you know, media every day. And they do cl claim that we're quote unquote a sanctuary city. It's used by this administration as a club to take away critical funding that we use against gangs to keep our people safe here, and I'm not going to buy into that, their frame. Well, clearly, this is an issue with strong feelings on both sides. That won't surprise anyone. And tomorrow, this will be played out at City Hall in Westwood. We're back to you guys. Lena and Jeff. Okay, Dave.